Alright. It's 7 a.m. Only two hours until my first break. Just two hours. Ugh, I can't believe a man that dresses like that runs our floor's management. Is that a polyester suit? How did he ever get this position? Oh, right. It's because Jerry is writing the CEO's- Richard! Huh, what can I do for you? Oh, God. Now he's blabbering on again. Ugh. I think I can see some kale on his teeth. I can definitely smell it on his breath. Who the hell eats kale for breakfast anyway? Fucking vegans. Ugh, finally. I swear if I had to pretend to care for one more second, no judge would hold me accountable for what I would do to him. Hello, Veronica. I never noticed how much of a fox she was before now. Damn, she has got to have the finest... And I am now being sued for sexual harassment. Wow. Before I even finished my thought. You'd think with the money for that kind of legal representation, we would have fewer deaths by elevator than we do. Is that Ted from high school? I didn't know he worked here. I never even thought he had the mental capacity to graduate high school. If it is him, that must have been quite an interview. So, what makes you qualified to join Stanford and Company? Uh, I threw balls very far. <laughs> God, what a douche. Ted, is that you? How long has it been? Oh god, I've made a terrible mistake. Now, now. This can't be too bad. I mean, how long could he really go for? Okay, he can go on for longer than I thought. Alright, I need an out. Think. How can I get out of this? Well, that worked quite nicely. What's this? We are glad you're feeling better and that we'll get to see your face around the office. Well, about time someone appreciates this mug. Also, congratulations on your recent promotion to part. Are you fucking kidding me? This is for Marshall. Of fucking course this wasn't for me. No one wants to send anything to Clark. No one likes Clark. Those monkey-humping, pea-brained... Oh no. My bandage is leaking. Someone call 911. Oh, right. Someone call 5 years of work I give this company and they make that tool bag Marshall partner in two what a crock of shit there he is just clicking his pen over and over and over I'd ask how anyone gets their work done around here with that noise but no one does get any work done around here
With all of the incompetence in this company, why do I even stick around? Everyone else are a bunch of mouth-breathing morons that wouldn't know a stock from the last donut in the box in the break room. I should just leave them all and let this place fall apart without me here. As they all get laid off and the company goes out of business, they'll realize they were little more than apes compared to me. And yet, I find myself sitting here. After all of this time. I guess... That's how it will have to be. Okay, Marshal! You have to it! Out of all of the reasons to end up in prison, this is by far the most worth it. At least I don't have to go to work tomorrow.